A small South African company is heading for a major breakthrough in the local mining sector with its use of technology that unlocks gold and other metals from sulphur deposits in Barberton. Biomin, an unlisted company, uses so-called biox technology that involves bacteria eating the sulphur that locks up gold in greenstone deposits containing a mix of minerals. JSC and London listed Pan African Resources is already using the technology. Barberton is one of South Africa's oldest commercial gold mining areas and was the site of the country's first gold rush. Business Day visited Barberton and spoke to Biomin Managing Director Jan van Niekerk about how the technology works. Van Niekerk says using Biox is cost effective and environmentally friendly. The technology has already been applied successfully in other parts of the world. It's a bio hydrometallurgical process. Um, it's for recovery of refractory gold, or gold locked in sulfide minerals, which means that gold is very fine and it's in pyrite, or in pyrite. No matter how fine you melt it, you just can't expose the gold for the cyanide to be able to recover that gold. Um, so you need a process to break down that sulfide matrix. Now you can do it with temperature, high temperature, the roasting process, you can do it with high temperature and high pressure, fresh oxidation, or you can do it with bacteria, um, the box process. Um, and it involves basically just taking that concentrate, that, that uh, concentrate containing all the sulfide minerals and the gold, um, adding the bacteria and maintaining the right conditions for the bacteria to do what they do. We've shown over the years with testing on all tailing stamps that that is a stable form for arsenic. Um, so you can deposit it on the tailings dam and don't have to worry about the future long term effects. He also explains how the bacteria are taken care of. The bacteria are a naturally occurring bacteria. Um, it's the same bacteria that is responsible for acid mine drainage. Um, we've just taken that bacteria and over the years through adaptation got them used to operate in a, a more aggressive way. Um, to operate it uh, higher slurry higher solids concentrations in slurry um, and more efficiently. Um, optimum temp uh, conditions for bacteria is uh, about 40 degrees, um, a pH of about 1.2 and then you just add like, dissolved oxygen and uh, nutrients and you maintain the bacteria within that optimum condition. At Pan Africa's Bremba Trailing Retreatment Project, technological innovation also helps it add more gold each year at low cost to its mining output in Barberton.